Dragon Man is a butt. Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. This is Eternity of Pain. This is the third iteration, week four. We're going to be fighting Dragon Man. And as you heard already, he's a butt. Anyway, uh, I started to go in here, and then I forgot that I was uh, in another quest, just farming. And, and No, actually, I was uh, doing the uh, uncollected, uncollected uh, monthly event quest. And I was like, you know what? I could do that later. I'm capped out on my energy, whatever. So as usual, you see, I have plenty of time left, a whole two hours left to do this. So I saw some videos and I know who I'm going to go in here with. I want to do Magneto and Quicksilver. Magneto I have as a six star rank three. Quicksilver I have as a five star only. All right, now Magneto is awesome for this, but it was a pain. Sometimes the AI didn't play right. Sometimes the RNG wasn't in my favor. I was trying all kinds of different things. I was like, okay, he's magnetized. Let me parry him. Oh no, I got the D-Gen. Let me restart. All right, parry me. Okay, I didn't get the D-Gen this time. Cool, parry, parry. All right, well, I got the D-Gen that time. It, it was annoying. Um, sometimes he shut off the uh, unstoppable. Sometimes he didn't. I was doing well. Uh, in one run, and then the unstoppable. And I was like, whoa, whoa, what's going on? And then I got trapped in a corner. It was over. All right. You'll get to see all of those later. Uh, I'm going to show you first my final runs on both the uh, uh, Magneto and with Quicksilver. Then after that's over, I'm going to post up... Um, in this video, at the end, you're gonna see all of my bloopers. All right, so you can see here, I parried him, did not get the D-Gen on me, okay? Um, I'm evading, he's a really annoying, annoying! All right, and you see I got the D-Gen this time, okay? And so I was like, okay, I'm just gonna block all of these, boom. I'm just racing to get enough prowess, okay? I wanna get enough prowess so that when I launch my special three, the fight's over. And I have been trying to do that for a while. You'll see if you want to watch my bloopers. You'll see. Sometimes Dragon Man sidestepped me and, and countered me. And sometimes he uh, intercepted me. It was ugly. It was ugly, y'all. Okay. So here we go. You know, I'm sitting here at two bars of power. And then he just starts punching on me. He's unblockable. Uh, fortunately, I got uh, got him away from me there. And you see now I'm charging up. I'm charging up. I'm like, okay, come on. I just need to charge all the way up. Come on, throw your special. Throw your special. All right, there we go. Okay, he threw it right in time for the parries to go off. And now I'm almost dead. And I'm like, are you kidding me? But I got up to the 36, I think it was 36, that I needed. Boom, boom, boom ugly but that was what i've been trying to do for the longest time one of the things that i noticed with magneto you either do it right and get a solo or don't do it because it was annoying let me tell you but i knew that i would get the solo or not you know it was like get to the 36 prowess fire my special three fights over now i have a six star rank three um i was watching uh who was it nick i think uh, or MCOC Noob, using a five-star Magneto. And they had to build up a lot more. I think they built up to like 50. And I remember looking at it going, why are they, you know, so much? Usually it's not that much. It's because they were using a five-star. And I think it was a rank four even, not even a maxed out five-star. So we got that done. Now, I don't know how to play Quicksilver. I've seen videos, I see a little bit, but... A lot of my mistakes and bloopers were learning to play Quicksilver and what I needed to do. And I'll tell you this much. I actually had a little bit more fun with Quicksilver than with the Magneto. So um, I'm just going in. And what I want to do, I want to build up to 300 momentum. That puts a slow on them. 
and I don't have to worry about the unstoppable. Now, hitting him with a heavy attack, like that, now I can build momentum up even faster, which is why you see me dashing back. And here's the thing about me and dashing back. I usually don't do well. I'm an aggressive type of a fighter. So if it's a style where I have to back off, back off, back off, I usually don't do well. And I'll get caught. Oh man, wait till you see uh, the bloopers. So many times I got caught. Uh, some of them, I don't even know why I got caught because all I was trying to do was back up, right? All right, so here we have 300, we're over 300 momentum. So we don't have to worry about the uh, unstoppable. At this point, it's pretty straightforward. Um, you have to worry about his unblockable, of course, but I'm just racing to get to, uh, what is it, terminal velocity, which I think, what is it, 900 or a 999, something like that. Um, one thing that was getting me was the power control because sometimes I was baiting out his uh, special, but he didn't have a special because I had shut him down. All right, so I'm at terminal, terminal velocity right here. All right, so I fire off my special three. Now, he's gonna be stunned after this. And you saw he didn't have that much power. So I get to go ham on him, all right? Now, one thing that I learned is that if I'm controlling their power a lot, I'm gonna need to learn how to evade a bit better. I mean, uh, intercept a bit better with him, all right? And see, I've decided to block that. It's just safer, safer to block it, all right? So you see here, we're still in terminal velocity. We don't have to worry about the unstoppable. And I'm trying to get to a special two. And he just wouldn't fire his special one. And now he doesn't have one. And I'm look at this. That that happened because I was trying to force a play. I was trying to force him to attack me so I could intercept him. And he wouldn't. So annoying. But I got a lot of his health down. And so now I'm like, ooh, I'm almost at another special three thanks to the boost. I think. No, 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 not the boost. Um because I think I that was a mutant. I think I did a mutant boost at that time. Uh, but anyway, so at this point, I'm, I'm trying to get back to 300. We got an intercept in there. Okay. And I'm backing off, backing off. All right. So we've got the slow on him. Don't have to worry about that. We really want to be in terminal velocity at this point. But I was like, you know what? He's got me in the corner again. Let's just go. Hopefully, you know, I can evade the first part of his special two and then block the rest of it. That seems to be the safest for me. Even if he's unblockable, when you evade that first part, he's no longer unblockable. So now I'm like, come on, man. Do not fire your special three. Okay, there we go. See how I dash back and then just block the dash back, evaded that first part, his unblockable went away, and then we could block the rest of it. Okay, so now... We're in terminal velocity again. And we're just going in, baiting out specials and going in. And that's pretty much the fight. So I'm like, okay, I think I got this. I think I got this. You know, I've learned a little bit. You know, sometimes he, he don't want to play right, but we, we got him, we got him. Don't get trapped in the corner. Hit into his block if he's unblockable and, and doesn't have a special. Hit into the block to get yourself some distance. All right, that wither is sweet, but I wasn't ready for it. So I wasn't ready for him not to have power. So I was still playing him like he didn't. Now, look, I want y'all to watch this. Okay, I got caught, right? I have 1%, so watch this. Ah, uh, what the heck? All right, so let me tell you what I was trying to do. I do this all the time with uh, Hercules and other champions. I wanted him, I wanted to bait out and attack dash back and fire my special while they were still committed. Apparently I can't do that with Quicksilver, or at least I can't do it with the timing that I was gonna do it. Because I dashed back, fired my special, but he had time, funny enough, against Quicksilver, he had time to recover and block. Because I just wanted to get him with, with you know, a little bit, because I knew I was gonna die anyway. All right, so here's my second attempt, and I'm like, okay, I, I, I think I've got this fight. First thing I gotta do is get that unstoppable out of my hair, 
Okay, and here he is. I got to deal with the special two again. It's unblockable, but there we go. And now it's not. And just block it because that doesn't do a lot of damage into your block. All right, we're still dealing with the unstoppable because I'm not at 300. I wasn't able to get a uh, heavy off. Okay, and now we should be good. All right, so now I'm like, okay, I just got to do the same thing I did the first time. Easy peasy, right? So we got this. All right. So now that I don't have to deal with the unstoppable, I can just basically bait out specials. Counter him. If he doesn't have a special, you know, hit into his block and he catches me there. It happens. I was getting a little too excited, but I was like, all right, all right. He caught me a little bit. Good thing he didn't catch me full, like in the corner. And there we go with that again. Just block it all, block it all. All right, still going in. Race into that special three. Okay, and I'm gonna learn. Um, I've already learned a bit more about Quicksilver just from this fight. And I do want him. All right, so here we go. Now at this point, I'm like, okay, I can get terminal velocity, which is why you see me just starting to dash back. Now that right there, if he had been unblockable, he would have caught me and in the, in the, it would have been over. I don't know why it does that sometimes, you know, because obviously I'm trying to build up to terminal velocity. So I'm just trying to dash, uh, dash back. All right. So here we go. Still dashing back. There we go. Terminal velocity. Fire off the special three. Now, here's something I think I, I got myself on this because you want the whiplashes to expire. Right. Um, you, you, you build them up. And then you want them to expire. Okay, so I've gotten a whole bunch of whiplashes. Look at that, all that, all that good stuff. Now at this point, I think if they expired, I'd be good. Not sure. But I refreshed them. And I'm like, ah, okay. I was like, all right, let me let me let them go. But then I dash back and they got refreshed again. And I'm like, no, I wanna explode them. And I was like, okay, was it the special one that exploded him? No, it wasn't that one. Okay, see, like I said, I didn't know uh, Quicksilver. And so all this, he should have been dead. And I'm just like, ah, how do I do it? How do I do it? And I'm just like, all right, all right. He only has like 3% left. We got this. We can get him, we can get him. You know, just even with regular hits, we can get him. All right, and so I'm just like, all right. Uh, uh, I, and then that happened. I was like, are you kidding me? An accidental parry. And then I tried to fire the special one off to try and finish him off. Oh man, you don't know. I was like, no, I did not mean to parry him right there. And once I parried him, I knew I was dead. And I tried to get him before I went. It didn't work. And I'm like, oh man. But at least I knew this time I wasn't gonna have to build up I should be able to just take him out straight. And we have a uh, double item use on right now. So I was like, let me use these level ones real quick. I ain't using them for nothing else. And uh, we should be able to finish him off. Oh man, I was so upset about that, man. I was so upset about that. Definitely could solo this if I wanted to keep trying, um, which I did not. I was, I was ready to go. Um, I had just eaten uh, uh, some lunch and everything. And I was ready to go. And in about 40 minutes or so, uh, we're going to have the final week. And I may do it uh, day one. We'll see. Uh, you guys may not see it till tomorrow, though. Um, but I won't do a live stream today. You'll see this video in its place. But then I'll probably end up doing the... Um, the uh, uh, last week. I'll look at some people do it and then maybe I'll do it later on uh, this evening or something like that. Um, but yeah, we're on pace for the uh, top milestone as you will see there. All right, so now you get a chance to see my bloopers if you wanna see them, all right? So take care, hit the like button if you enjoyed it, leave a comment, let me know what you thought about the video and you all have a blessed day.
trust me if you must, but know that I can't trust myself. This story is never ending. Everything at play, the landscape, mind bending.
Expect them. 